welcome to my channel and thank you for clicking on today's video. Today is going to be an exciting video because it's going to be an unboxing! Now these are early Christmas presents which I cannot wait to unbox because I already want to be able to use it before the holiday begins and I'm just impatient and I already want to open presents. So let's go ahead and jump right into it. First item that I want to open is a little something from Yves Saint Laurent. Excuse my accent. So this is from my sweet sister and brother-in-law, which I'm sure my sister is watching this. So thank you, sister. Oh, by the way, if you want to follow my sister, she has a YouTube channel called Life of French, which I'm going to link down below. So make sure to follow her. It came in this paper bag and... I actually already know what's inside, but I don't know which color did my sister pick, so it's gonna be a surprise. So inside the bag, it came in, um, I think this is the receipt. Yes, it is. It was bought from Yves Saint Laurent in Harrods. And here's the gift. Ah! Oh my gosh, what color did she choose for me? <laughs> So, in the box, it just came with this one. It has a dust bag and <laughs> I already see the color. Ta-da! A card case. And of course, she chose black for me, which I'm so happy about. I'm the kind of person who wants to add color to my wardrobe, but I always choose black or white. I don't know why, but I love color on other people. But when it comes to buying something for myself, I would usually choose the neutral color. So I'm so glad my sister got me this. Oh my gosh, it's so pretty. It comes with this pebbled leather and it has a YSL logo in the color gold. So it has three, five card slots. Oh, six, because it has one in the middle and then inside the dust bag so cute it has what is inside what's this what's this oh what is that so it's a small it's a small envelope that says Yves Saint Laurent and oh it has the, um, what's this, the product code or serial number. It says made in Italy, uh, Porte Cartes, blah, 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 blah. <laughs> and other things about the card case. So let's take this off. Oh, it's so pretty. So I really wanted to have a card case because I already have a small wallet, but this is perfect for when I still want to downsize from that smaller wallet and it would fit all my bags, whether it's small or big, this is perfect. So that's the first thing that I got and I'm going to put it right here for some eye candy. Now, the next thing that I want to unbox is a gift from Charbel, and it's from Valentino. Ah. Of course, I already know what's inside because he asked me what I wanted for Christmas. And of course, I said I wanted some gorgeous pair of heels. I already know what's inside, but I'm still going to unbox it and share it with you guys. And also, it came in a beautiful wrapping paper. I think this was also from Valentino. It's like this animal skin or like reptile skin pattern, but of course it's not. It's just paper. But I've already unwrapped, unwrapped, <laughs> unwrapped it. So it came in this and this is the box and I'll open it now. Let's see. Ta-da! Okay. It's all over the place. These are the receipts. Let's keep it in the box. And inside the box, you'll see this one, which has the dust bag and like some care instructions. And I can feel some extra studs also over there. So that's a hint. It has studs. So there you go. 
And then let's open it. These are the Rock Stud uh, pumps and it's in the nude color. This came in, um, I think the Valentino pumps has two shades of um, nude, but this is the one with like a pink or purplish undertone, I would say. So, it's so pretty! Let me just remove all this paper inside just so we can really see the beauty of the shoes. <laughs> now, these are the Valentino Rock Stud Pumps and I got it in the color Nude. They have two different kinds of nudes. Like, they have one which is in a beigey undertone and this is in a pinkish or purplish undertone, which I love and ah, it's so beautiful! <sighs> can't believe I have my very own pair. I remember I was just admiring this from celebrities and models back when I was in college and now I have my very own pair. So I'm so excited. I've always wanted to get myself my very own pair of this Rockstead pumps but the very first time I was ready to get this I was in Istanbul and they only had one pair in my size. However, the only pair that they had had some scuffing or like, I don't know, something was wrong in the leather on the heel of the shoe. So I wasn't ready to pay that much for a shoe that's already not perfect. There was also another time when Charbo was in Munich and I asked him to find these shoes for me and he went to two Valentino stores and one of them had my size, which is the last pair as well. However, that shoe had like some dots on this part and like two black dots and it cannot be removed or wiped off. I don't know what that is. And also one of the studs were like in the wrong direction. I don't know what's wrong with Valentino quality but I passed on that as well. And then we asked one of Charbel's friends who was going to London to get these shoes for me and we were thinking like Maybe I shouldn't do it because I have bad experience with finding the Valentino shoes. However, this came in such a perfect condition. Like, I don't see any imperfection on these shoes. It's perfect and he bought it in the Valentino store in Harrods. And I love it. It's so beautiful. And I can't wait to wear it during the holidays. So thank you so much to my boyfriend for getting me these shoes. And last but not the least is something from Chloe and this is a gift from me to me and I'm so excited to open this and let's go ahead and open this big one first. I think this is the Chloe um, holiday gift wrapping because it originally comes with this um, design like a lighter bow, a lighter pink bow and this color of logo but this is more like gold metallic -y one so I'm so excited this was bought this particular one was bought in London I asked my sister to be my personal shopper while she was there so she bought this in Bun Street and let's go ahead and open it I specifically asked my sister to go to a Chloe boutique because I wanted to come in a Chloe paper bag and a box. So I didn't want her to go to Harrods or Selfridges because they don't usually put it in a Chloe paper bag and box. So it came in this one and it has a Chloe logo as well. And ta-da! It's wrapped in this tissue paper which has a sticker also that says Chloe and ah, it comes in a dust bag and obviously you can already see that it's a handbag and it also has a logo on the dust bag and here's a peek it's the Chloe Nile Minadoue, whatever in French, or it's also called Nile, um, Chloe Nile Half Moon Bag. And I chose the off white color, which is so beautiful. 
Um, I'll go ahead and remove all the wrapping paper so that we can really see the beauty of this handbag. Now, this is the handbag and it is so beautiful. Oh my gosh. So, I got this in the color of white. It's more of like a beigey undertone kind of white and I love it. Like, this bag actually comes in many beautiful colors which at first I wasn't sure what I really wanted to choose because everything is just so beautiful. I was almost gonna choose the one which is the new season color. It's like a grayish but with a blue undertone kind of bag or kind of color I mean. But I was thinking if I really want to get the most wear out of it, I should get the neutral color, which is this off-white. So I went for this and yeah, I don't regret it. It's just so beautiful. So the Chloe Nile bag comes in two different styles. They have this one, which is half moon, and another one, which is the regular one, which is a little bit um, bigger. It's like a full moon kind of bag. And yeah. This bag has this beautiful handle. The handle is like a brushed uh, gold while the detail over here, the, the one that's dangling over here which is with the charms, it's more of a shiny gold. So this handbag is just so beautiful. It's so unique and it gives me like this classy boho feel. So I love it and I know it would complement an outfit very well. It's already like a piece of jewelry or an accessory in itself because of the handle. Like you can wear it on your arm and such. So this handbag comes in this shiny gold hardware for the charm. But then the handle and this detail over here is more of an antique kind of gold. But I love it. Like... How smart are they? Like, how would they know that it complements each other even though it's a different kind of gold? I just love Chloe. I feel that they always make it bags which are unique and beautiful. And what I love about Chloe handbags is that it's unique. The shape is unique. The design is unique. It's not similar to any other design houses. So I love it. And yeah. So that's the handbag. Before I talk about the handbag a little bit more, I think this is the perfect time to unbox the second one, which came in this paper bag. So let's lay this down here. And... It comes in this cute little box, and this paper bag smells so good. Like, this other one... I think they didn't spray any perfume on this. This was actually bought in Bun Street and this was this one was bought in Sloan Street because this one is not available in Bun Street at that time. So yeah, it smells so good. So it came in this cute little box which says Chloe as well. And once you open it, ah, has a cute little dust bag and you have also a card over here. I think these are like care instruction and like the serial number and such. So I'm gonna keep this here. And... Ah, I got a bag charm and I got the letter R for my name, Ruth. And it's just so pretty and so delicate. So I'm gonna go ahead and attach it onto the bag. I'm gonna keep the C because other than Chloe, it also means Charbel, so it's perfect. It's like Ruth and Charbel. How cheesy is that? But whatever. <laughs> I love it. Let's attach it. So, ta da! It's so beautiful. Can you see it? Let's see. R, C. And then there's like a small circular thing which has a Chloe engraving on it. It's so beautiful and perfect. Oh my god, I think this is my favorite bag at the moment. So oh, I'm so excited to wear this handbag. And let's go ahead and open it so I can show you further about the bag. So at the back, you have this um, slot for some cards. And then in the front is like this. It's like a magnetic closure. So I'll keep this sticker on this one. And this is how it looks like inside. Some tissue paper. Oh, 
something fell. It came in this Chloe, I think, authenticity card as well, and some care instructions. Here we go. And then, inside the bag, you just have a small card slot once again. And let's see if my iPhone 7 Plus fits onto this handbag. And it fits perfectly. And there's still more space for some more essentials. Let's say this card case. Hi, baby. <laughs> my boyfriend is watching me. So this card case, see? This card case fits perfectly over here as well. And I think I can still fit my car keys and a few lipsticks. So this handbag is perfect because I don't really care carry that much whenever I'm going out. So this is such a perfect handbag and that's the reason why I asked my sister to get me a card case as a gift so that it fits this handbag perfectly. Ah, I'm so happy! Another thing that I love about this handbag is that it's understated. Even the logo is just stamped onto the leather and it's very discreet. So not everyone would know it's a Chloe handbag or would even know that it's a designer handbag. Not unless you're into designer bags. This handbag comes with a strap so you can just go ahead and strap it on both sides over here and wear it as a crossbody or over the shoulder. You can also wear this as a clutch just like that or you can just hold it just like this or put it over your arm like that. So you can wear this many ways and style it many ways. So I'm so excited to wear this bag. So if you want me to do like an outfit video um, showing you how I style this bag, give this video a like and I might just do that. All right, so that's it for this unboxing. Thank you so much for joining me in today's video. I hope that you guys enjoyed it as much as I do. And if you have any video suggestions, don't forget to leave a comment down below. And again, don't forget to give this video a like and subscribe. And I wish you an awesome and beautiful holiday and Merry Christmas!